With his treachery laid bare, Admiral Zarin is wasting no time in pursuing his campaign against the Empire. He has hundreds of starships in his command, as well as the bulk of the new TIE Advanced Starfighter fleet. Zarin has clearly spent months planning this coup attempt. Though he failed to remove the Emperor from power, he is still in a formidable position to do serious damage to the Empire with the resources currently at his disposal. Combined with his intimate knowledge of our fleet deployments and base locations, he is systematically targeting critical facilities throughout the Empire in an attempt to cripple our forces. One such strike is being made against our main TIE Advanced Starfighter research and production facilities in the Omar system. By crippling our ability to manufacture the TIE Advanced, he will maintain a significant technological edge against our forces. The local defences currently stationed at Omar cannot stop this attack, so we must evacuate as many personnel as we can. The highly skilled workforce at these plants is vital to keeping the Imperial Navy equipped with the most advanced starfighter technology. They must be saved. Vice Admiral Thrawn has taken command of our forces in the area and you will be assigned to his flagship, the Victory Class Star Destroyer Stalwart and his task force. At least two of our factories, Omars 3 and 4, have already been evacuated, but personnel are still awaiting rescue from the remaining plants and the main R&D facility itself. Your mission is to hold off the attacking forces long enough to ensure the safe withdrawal of all personnel from these facilities. You must ensure all evacuation transports jump away safely to Admiral Thrawn's task force. You will be the flight lead Alpha-1 with three wingmen in TIE Defenders and armed with advanced concussion missiles. We believe at least two of Zarin's modified frigates are leading the assault and will be launching waves of TIE bombers to attack the facilities escorted by TIE advanced fighters. It is also likely the assault will have additional support from enemy stormtrooper transports and assault gunboats, so watch out for more forces hypering into the area. Once the evacuation transports have successfully completed their missions, return to the task force for your next assignment. We have received a distress call from our main TIE advanced factories in the Omar system. They are under attack from Admiral Zarin's forces. Four TIE defenders from Alpha Group will hyper in to assist local defences whilst we evacuate our remaining personnel. The enemy will likely be launching waves of bombers against the plants and using their own TIE advance to cover them. You are to provide protection over the withdrawal of our people and see our rescue craft to safety. We would like to save the plants, but the lives of Imperial personnel are our primary concern. Firing at me, another bandit. 
down. Woo! Woo! Another bandit down. Whoa! Got him. This is two. I've got a starship firing at me. Got him. Message from Mission Critical Craft. They have started boarding operation. This is four. I'm having trouble over here. This is four. I'm hit. Great shot.
We saved a great number of skilled technicians from certain death at the hands of Zarin's traitorous forces. The surprise coup attempt by Admiral Zarin, former head of research and development for Starfighter Technology, has left Imperial forces on the defensive. His inside knowledge of the Empire's key military industrial facilities leave them extremely vulnerable to attack. Whilst Zarin's exact motivations and ultimate plans are unclear at this point, his forces are as great a threat as the rebels to the survival of the Empire. We can certainly expect more attacks from Zarin very soon. <laughs> 